Hey fellow Blender Maniacs, Alex Cordobar here and I'm excited to bring to you this brand new Blender 2.8 course. As you know, Blender has completely changed with the new version 2.8 and this course goes from A to Z of 3D animation in Blender 2.8. So check it out, there's a promotional code, limited time promotional code going on right now for $9.99, link in the description. Check out the course, check out this video and if it speaks to you, get the course. I know you're going to love it. Once again, I poured my heart and my soul into this. And once again, it's in the new Blender 2.8, which you're absolutely going to love. So I'll see you in the course. Ciao for now. Au revoir. Hey, have you ever wanted to create some awesome 3D artwork, but you just didn't know where to start? Do you find yourself like this guy? All right, let's do this. I'm excited. Oh. Well, if that's you, you've come to the right place. You see, I believe that we all have a story that we want to tell. A story that's in our imagination and that we want to bring forth into the world and share with others. And the art of 3D is one of the best ways to do that. Now, if you've never touched the 3D arts program, no problem, because we're going to be taking you from A to Z, from the very basics to the more advanced stuff of how to take whatever you have in your imagination and bring it forth into the world of 3D. So what is Blender? I don't get it. No, not exactly. Blender is a free 3D arts program where you could create literally anything. My name is Alex Corbord, and for the last 10 years, I've been doing and teaching 3D arts and animation to tens of thousands of students. I have a bestseller on Udemy with over 10,000 students, and on my website and my YouTube, I have tens of thousands of students as well. All right, we're gonna kick off this course by taking a look at Blender 2.8's new user interface, which has completely changed. There are a lot of new changes, and so we're gonna take a look at all these new changes in Blender 2.8. We're then going to go into basic modeling, texturing, and animating and lighting by creating some simple little scenes such as this. That way we can lay the groundwork for what we need to know in 3D arts and animation. We're then going to continue by creating some simple little animations such as this one, which again will teach us the key fundamentals of animation so that we could have that groundwork. Once we've done the basics, we're going to go into more intermediate modeling and texturing such as creating some cool assets such as this bridge and learn about normal maps, diffuse maps, roughness maps, and a bunch of other things and we're going to learn the intermediate skills of modeling and texturing. Once we've done that, we're going to go into animating, intermediate animating by learning lattices and graph editors and really cool things like this so we could create this cool animation of a ball squashing and stretching and again learn the fundamentals then we're gonna go into everybody's favorite thing sculpting we're gonna learn all the different brushes and sculpt this really cool dragon looking type head once we've done that we're gonna kick it off into uh, rigid body physics and cloth simulation and again this part is really fun in the course we're gonna create some really cool things such as this little domino effect here and also a lot of other little projects along the way and then for the final bang, the final project in the, in the course is a full blown out animation from start to finish. We're going to model a character from start to finish. Once we've modeled the character, we're going to go ahead and rig the character or add bones to the character. That way we could animate the character and pose the character. Once we've animated or rigged the character, we're actually going to go ahead and texture the character or add in colors to the character. That way our character can have more character, no pun intended. And then once we've uh, textured our character and made him a nice color, we're then going to go into actually animating our character and creating a walk cycle. How cool is that? We're not only going to create a walk cycle, but a full blown out animation. So we're going to take everything we learned in the course, modeling, texturing, rigging, animating, lighting, everything, and create a full blown out animation like you see right here. Again, learning all the skills we learned in these 20 plus hours of this course, which is absolutely jam-packed, we're then going to all put it together into a final animation. 
So this course has it all. It's from A, not knowing anything at all about 3D arts animation, to Z, being competent, having the skills and knowledge and know-how to create some really awesome 3D arts animation, putting all those skills together, and along the way, creating some really cool projects that you could be proud of, all in the brand new Blender 2.8. So with that, join me along this journey. It's going to be an absolute ride and a blast. Click the button, purchase the course, make the investment. It's an awesome investment, like I said, in your education and learning and having fun. So with that, I will see you in the course. I cannot wait to see what you create within the course. And by the way, as we go along the course, there's going to be assignments and projects so that as you learn, you're actually creating stuff that you could be proud of, that you could share with friends and family. All right, I will see you in the course. Cannot wait to see what you create. Ciao for now, au revoir, and let's go blending.